So drillers will throw out the first pitch of their season at 7.05 tonight. And before we head out to the field, we want to let you know about some new parking options. All new this morning, 2 News reporter Dan Perlman is live inside One Oak Field right now with what you need to know. You trying out for the team, Dan? Uh, no, Justin, <laughs> but... Uh... Well, from what I've seen of your athletic ability, that's probably for the best, Dan. Well, I think this is an argument we probably shouldn't get in on live TV, so I'm just going to move on and mention how there is a lot of construction going on around One Oak Field right now in the Brady District. The good news is, though, if you come down to the game tonight or really any night this year, parking should be just fine. In fact, there's a little bit more, and I'm joined now by Mike Malega, the GM for the Tulsa Drillers. Mike, tell me a little bit about what's going on over here on Brady and Archer when it comes to parking. Great. Well, there's just a lot of progress. Obviously, there's lots of construction, but fans, I don't think you need to worry or be concerned about coming to One Oak Field this year. Um, Brady is going to be open, even though there's a lot of projects going on. Brady's going to be open two hours prior to every game this season. Uh, the folks doing a lot of the projects will make sure that that is open for fans. So two-way traffic all year long. Uh, parking options will be similar to last year. There, this year, there's additional street parking on Archer to displace the uh, the parking that was on Brady last year that won't be available. But in addition to that, on the weekends, as it was the first two seasons, OSU Tulsa is going to be available for free parking for all of our fans Friday, Saturdays, and Sundays. Uh, there is the uh, Bank of Oklahoma lot uh, where their employee parking is. That will be available for some nightly parking as well. But the street parking on Archer uh, should make a big difference. If the fans, uh, you know, come out here and, and turn down Archer instead of Brady, I don't think they're going to notice a difference. Well, you pretty much just answered every parking question I have in that one answer, so that's perfect. <laughs> yeah. How excited are you guys, though, just for tonight in general? Obviously, opening night's a special night. Oh, it's the best day of the year. You know, we work hard for seven months. As soon as the season ends last year, we start working on this season. And uh, so this is the culmination of lots of great ideas. We've got some great changes to the ballpark that I think the fans are going to receive well. Uh, and we want to make One Oak Field a dynamic environment that's always improving for the fan experience. And I think we've done that this year. So you got to come out and see our splash zone and great new food and beverage offerings as well. Excellent, Mike. Thank you very much for joining us You're this welcome. morning. And, of course, the first pitch, like we have been saying all morning, is at 7.05. So if you want to come on out, be here by then. We're live in downtown Tulsa. Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you. All right. Thank you, Dan. And join us at the ballpark for 2 Works For You, $2 Tuesdays, and 2 News Family Fun Day Sundays. That gets started Sunday afternoon with our foam finger giveaway. The first pitch is set for 2.05. If the weather allows, we have more information at KJRH.com under the Sports tab.